gone in this tutorial we are going to go through static variable write a class that contains static variable that keeps track of how many objects of the class existing at the moment there should also be a static uh, function that returns this number each object in the class must also have an instance variable that is uh, automatically assigned a unique ID number when the object is created. It should not be possible to change this ID number after it has been initialized. Mark therefore the instance variable as read only. For this we are going to uh, start a new project uh, console application and name it and create it and it must uh, uh, be all those uh, uh, num uh, name spaces or uh, classes and we uh, use system trading here too and uh, the program class program has a main a method and the objects we are going to use student s1 new student uh, you can use another id but i have used it 101 until s6 to 106 and student dot counter we are con we are calling the method in the student class we are going to make a, a class student and for this we have a few variables a static integer count equals zero and then private int underscore id private int id its property and uh, we only use get only and then in public uh, student is constructor int id this dot underscore id equals to id this one and we are going to use count plus plus and in uh, another constructor we dot uh, in, in uh, another uh, method counter we dot any uh, mem uh, parameter we are going to use console right line count dot uh, to string okay we are going to run this program uh, I hope that you have uh, paused and write uh, copy those uh, code sources we are going to use control F5 to run the program And it is six. As you see, we have six items. Okay. Thank you for watching. See you on next tutorial.